to my channel hope you're all well today's look is a vintage inspired look the classic red lip and the flick so if you'd like to see how i created this look then stay tuned right so i'm starting with the nivea men post shave balm as my primer working that in as normal and then I'm going to go in with the Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer and this is in beige and I'm just going to use that to prep my eyes with before applying eyeshadow. Blending it out with my rose water and my beauty blender as normal. And then I'm going to take my Carly Bible BH Cosmetics eyeshadow palette starting with the softer matte shade this one here as my all over base color and I'll be working that all over my lid up to my eyebrow bone just to prep my eyes ready for color go in with my second shade which is kind of like a soft brown and I'm going to use this as my transition shade starting off in the crease and then working it up again just to blend it out nicely so we get no harsh lines with our eyeshadow my third shade which is a soft purple lavender kind of shade and I'm going to work that into my crease just to deepen it but not too harshly and then bring it out on my outer V then I go back in with the first colour that we use with a flat eyeshadow brush as like this one which is a morphe brush and we're going to go all over the lid just to define that crease shade then i'm going to go in with my liner designer by beauty blender it's kind of like a guitar pick kind of thing but um, you use it basically to do your winged eyeliner to get that straight edge and get it nice and crisp and I'm going to use my Kat Von D tattoo liner in Trooper and it's new and it is amazing by the way I would recommend it to everyone and anyone that wants a great liquid eyeliner I go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in medium brown. This again is new and I found it amazing. I love a fine eyebrow pencil just so you can get those hair like strokes with it so it doesn't look like you've sharpied your eyebrows on. So again I would recommend this to people and I got it from beautybay.com for $15.50 which I didn't think was too bad. go in with my Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Mascara starting off with the opening act side which is basically um, a primer for your eyes I think it also helps to lengthen them as well which I find amazing with this mascara and then I go in with the normal mascara end so my lashes go from white to black basically <laughs> And then I take the Red Cherry Lashes in Stevie, then going back in with my Carly Bible B 
BH Cosmetic eyeshadow palette and using the highlighter just to highlight under my eyebrows to define the arch and it really does open up your eyes. I also take it to the inner corners of the eyes and this makes you look more awake and just give you that fresh look. Then today I'm using the Rimmel Match Perfection foundation and the concealer both in ivory to do my face makeup today again these are both new products and I was really impressed with them um, I still prefer the L'Oreal true match foundation but this one was basically just me running out and I had to grab something ASAP I don't know what it is about the L'Oreal True Match foundation, I just love it, it's cheap and cheerful and it seriously is an amazing foundation, but this did work really nicely and the concealer was really nice, really nice and creamy and blended out nice, and this I just got from my local Asda store, so it's easy to get hold of. Then going back in with that second eyeshadow shade that we used which was the light brown colour and just basically lining my eyes with it so my bottom lashes don't look bare and it all blends nicely. Then I go in with my Zoeva Coral Blusher Palette. I didn't want too much blusher on this one because I find with vintage looks they almost look really pale and it's all about the red lip and the winged eyeliner. Then I'm going back in with that highlighter that we used under our eyebrows and I'm just highlighting in the usual places that I do. liner in primal and I go all over my lips as kind of like a base so the lipstick that I wear just lasts a bit longer matte liquid lipstick and this is in rebel red really liked this this again was just from my local asda store so it was easy to pick it up and it is lush <laughs> watching this one hope you enjoyed it give me a big thumbs up if you liked it don't forget to hit that subscribe button to stay tuned and I'll see you next time